Okay. And here we go. Here's another one. I couldn't lift these. My back is hurting, and I can't be lifting this stuff. So thank God for my husband and my friend that went with me today. My friend went with me. My husband got this stuff out of the car, and he's just so used to me coming home with, with these great deals. Clearance, grab bag, four bucks. All right. Here we go. Cardstock. Um, that's like a like a tan color, like a chestnut color, I guess. Walnut, like the color of a nut nutshell. One. These normally went. It said was four ninety nine. Then they marked it down to forty nine cents, and I got these. Oh my goodness. Um, 36 sheets, sheets in each package. One, two, three of them in this box, this one $4 box. Then I see I have a planner. <laughs> another planner. There was, I think, three or four in the four, first one. And here's another. This is absolutely beautiful. I mean, look at the size of this. Does it come with 18 month planner, monthly and weekly calendar page, a divider space for creativity, planning, and scheduling. These beautiful colors and the, uh, the folders. I, I just love this stuff. I, I cannot believe this came in my, uh, my grab bag box. All right. Another one, 18 month by the same company create 365. I'm sorry. I should hold that better. In front of the camera. It's got all the dividers. As you see, this is a heavy book. Then it comes with the pl it's the planner, monthly, weekly, calendar page, divider, space for creativity and planning, blah, blah, blah. And I even got in the box. Okay, so that's about six, seven. Well, I got two of the uh, planners in this box, and I got about five in the other. I got like seven of them all together. Then I get this Wilton cake pan, and Wilton makes some pretty good stuff. I guess that's Mickey's bow. Isn't that adorable? That is really nice to get that inside this uh, box here. More stuff. Check this out. Duct tape was marked down from $1.59 to $70, then $39. I'm sure if I find something to do with that. I am so sorry. I'm taking this stuff out, looking at it, and I'm not looking at the camera. You can tell I'm new to this. Then I got this. It looks some, like some sort of um, table numbers for a wedding. It's like ivory colored and gold. I'm trying to get it in the right angle here because of that, the way the light is hitting it. There's something else or what? The number one. This has silver. I'll probably put these on eBay. And there's the gold. Here's another one, number one with the gold, with the table numbers. Then this is, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, something to do, photo heritage, tent card, photo something, picture or story, I don't know what that says, anyway, hashtag something, anyway, um, I'm sure somebody's going to have use for this somewhere. And what else did I get? These little, I don't know, it looks like some sort of sequins. I'm sure we'll find something to do with that. And this is the last thing in the box. I have no idea what I'm looking at. Anybody know what this is? U.S. 5025 OCA. Oh, this is some weird looking stuff. What could this be? Looks like a giant nail. I don't know. Anybody know what this is? Link uh, on the links below. <laughs> Please let me know under the comments. I have no idea what that is. So these two items, whatever they are, I have no idea what they were cost. I mean, the baking pan, one, two, three, four, five, stationary wedding related uh, uh, table numbers and something to do with pictures. And one, two very big, um, oh boy, here we go again, two very big um, planner books. I mean, I just cannot believe I got all this today. This is the first time I've done a grab bag at Michael's and I am very happy with this. I don't expect I'll get this again. 
and these three cardstock packs of paper. Everybody, everything a uh, crafter could want. Boy, that was some deal. And I'll show you what my haul is, the things that I bought that were not in a bread bag. I'll try to move this along a little quicker. I got a Fiskars Paper Punch Heart Shape. Look at that. And it's one, I think it's like one and a half inches. It's not small. It's one of the bigger sizes. Look at that. It was marked down to $6.99, and it was 50% off. I paid $3.49 for that. That made my day. I got so excited. I went, oh, and the guy that worked there jumped. He goes, what's the matter? I said, I found a heart punch paper puncher. And boy, he looked at me like, lady, what is your problem? You almost gave me a heart attack. I was so happy to see that. This. I thought this was adorable. I'm going to do something for Father's Day project with it. I'm going to put a picture on it of my husband and my granddaughter. I'm going to decoupage several pictures of them on here without going too into it. And it's going to be a nice gift. I'm going to do a video of it. So I don't want to say too much more. Anyway, I got some stickers. These were 49 cents. And I got something fade. It's one of these things that you put over a picture and it gives it the different fading uh, effects with different colors. It's very pretty. Couldn't resist it for 49 cents. $2.49. I love these religious sayings. I just think these are so inspiring and beautiful. Um, I can do all things. Let your light shine. The Lord is my shepherd. Hope anchors the soul. That's my favorite. Hope anchors the soul. It sure does. God is love. I mean, I just love these. They're perfect for it, especially the holiday time. Then I find these are 50% off and I grabbed them because they had this, the orange, and the red. I grabbed the orange and the white because anybody that knows me knows I love fall. It's my favorite time of year, and I plan on making something with this. My daughter is just dying to get some of my fall crafts when I make them. Kristen, you know I will put them aside for you. But then I got these. These are adorable. Oh my God. These were in that area where everything's a dollar or a dollar fifty. So you got two of these in the pack. These are just adorable. I can't wait to do a craft with these, a DIY. Look at this. It's got the clothespin on the back, a little chalkboard. You could write a little note on it. I got two of them for a dollar fifty. So I bought a few packs of these. That will be a good um, DIY video coming up. Can't wait to do that one. Then I came across some of these um, decorative clothespins. Look at that. Is that adorable or what? You could put them on the refrigerator with magnet tape, paint a saying on them or decorate them. I just thought that was adorable. And it was only 39 cents for that pack. A little wooden clothespin. Okay, with Michael's today, they had a 50% off coupon for any regularly priced item, meaning it can't be a clearance item, can't be on sale, regular price. So I needed magnet tape for these projects that you see that I'm going to do. Thing is, I know I have magnet tape somewhere in my house. I don't have the time or energy to look through all of my closets. Um, so I grabbed this magnet tape, the biggest package they had, and it was $6.00 and like 25 cents, so the 50% off coupon I applied to this. I got it for $3, all that magnet tape. But that was my happy day, the happy deal of the day. Then I even got some chalk, because with, e with each couple of these I give to someone as a gift, I'm gonna put a couple of pieces of chalk inside of a little uh, package for them. Pack it nicely so it doesn't break. While I was at it, of course, I had on clearance, 33 cents each. Last time it was like 50% off on top of that. But these, I thought I could, I had to get a couple at that price. This is going to be for when I do my, some of my Christmas cards. And when I do um, my planner, Merry Christmas. I think this is the Washi brand. I'm not sure. Is that pretty or what? I love fall leaves. Wait till you see some of the fall leaf projects I do. I used to have a brownie troop when my daughter was very young. This was, gosh, she's 20, gonna be 29. This was about 24 years ago. 
I had her brownie troop 25 years ago, something like that. She was in first grade, I think it was. I had little six-year-old girls, I had a brownie troop, and we used to do so many craft projects. The mothers loved it, but especially in the fall. And I have so many things I would like to bring and show on YouTube that we used to do um, with the craft stuff. And here's another one, no peeking. Is that cute or what? I'd love to put that on some of the gifts that I wrap at Christmas time. Then, hello, hello, hello. I thought that was cute. But for 33 cents each, I mean, oh, this I saw. This I'm gonna use for when I make my Christmas tags and when I do some of my uh, other crafts. This was a good deal, this big, huge thing of twine. It was marked down several times, then to $2.99. I got it half off that, I got it for $1.50. And that's perfect for Christmas time, or every, all time of the year. You have to give it Valentine's. I mean, I just love that. I thought that was a great deal. And then I found a big clothespin for decorating. 47 cents is big. I don't know if it's, I think it's wooden. It's not plastic. I thought that was adorable. To go with the other one. And last but not least, the two more, a couple of more things. These were two for five dollars. I'm gonna melt some of the chocolate into the little molds. Some of my family members love homemade chocolate. Then I got these on. These were on clearance, and I could not resist these. This, 13 cents it was marked down to. I'd like to make a picture with it, some sort of a picture craft. It looks like, um, here it's in Manhattan, New York. I was born and raised. I thought that was pretty enough. For 13 cents, it was the last one they had. And this was 8 cents each. And I'm sure I could decoupage this. There's something to do with, I could do with this. This was so pretty. That was such a cheap price. Then I got these marked down to $1.27 as is. Supposed to have 10 sheets. Instead, there's nine. $1.27, I grabbed it because you could put the nice, dirty, thick plastic pictures in here and make a nice gift for somebody. You could decorate it, add stuff around the edge. You can hang it, have it on a wall. You can have it in a frame. There's so many things you could do with this. And with Father's Day coming up next week, I got some plans. All right, guys, that is my haul for today from Michaels. I hope you enjoyed watching it. I apologize for not getting into the camera. The lighting is off. Um, that's me. I am. You're not going to get perfect with me. I'm far from it. And I'm new to this, so please bear with me. If you like my video, please be kind with your comments. <laughs> but um, please feel free to join, and you will get my... Um, You'll get my notification every time I have a video coming out if you hit subscribe and tap the bell, and you'll know when I get a video coming out. So, all right, you have a great evening, and thank you for watching. Please come back again. Bye.